Yeah, after the after the trials in '88, uh, I didn't wrestle anymore. I, it was only, it was only a couple years after college. Um, I probably had another cycle in me, but I had some injuries and things like that, and and had gotten into coaching and um, just decided that that was a, a you know a full time profession. I was married and and uh, uh, had a had a child at the time. Uh, it was in 1990, and so the timing was just not right, and so just uh, moved on, and it's been been a blessing since then. Yeah, the the whole Olympic environment. I mean, I've been to several of them, uh, either as a as a spectator, or just uh, uh, um, just you know as a fan. Um, but being in there, we went to the the Olympic training camp, the one in Australia, their their uh, Olympic training center in Canberra, and we were there for for several weeks. Moved on to Sydney, and. Um, you know, by by the time you by the time you kind of get to the training camp, when, once you actually go over, and you're you're on on location, even uh, when we were in Canberra, uh, prior to going to Sydney, it's at that point it's just really tweaking the little things, almost almost like in the collegiate season. Once you've qualified, you're through the Big Ten. You wanna, um, you know, you have a couple weeks until competition, and you really just want to focus on what you're doing well. You want to get in some some great workouts, some hard workouts. By the same token. You know, it's about tapering, and getting ready, and scouting your opponents, and just being as prepared and feeling as well as you possibly can for the for the main event. Yeah, I went with uh, Charles Burton, who was uh, an assistant for me here. Uh, we were about the same weight class, uh, uh, and so we trained together all the time. I helped, I trained him, and through the trials and whatever, he ended up making that team. Uh, so I was kind of his training partner, his personal coach. Went with him to Sydney. Uh, was in all the um, uh, I wasn't because I wasn't credentialed to be on the Olympic staff, so I wasn't in his corner during that, but pretty much through the whole training process and um, uh, pretty much all up to the time that he would step on the mat, was uh, I was able to be involved in that. It was a great experience and, uh, you know, it was a lot of fun and, and hopefully it was beneficial to him.